Marge, I wish you'd quit writing me. I wish I wish you'd quit writing me every Sunday. You're, you're, it seems like you uh, pester me uh, that I don't go to church. Marge, Jill, Jill, I don't need to go to church. I don't need to go to church. I'm smarter than than anybody. I won't mention his name. But uh, I'm smarter than anybody. I know what the score is. I know what's happening in the world. I, I know what's... I, I don't know everything, but I know most things. And I don't need to go to church to be a believer. And I believe that I'm going to heaven. I believe that it's going to be my winning smile that gets me into heaven. And, uh, well, I'm, I'm a good person. I'm a good person, a good round person, Marge. What's your name? What's your name? Jill? Yeah. Anyway, uh, we're not going to send the weapons to Israel. And I know, I know that they're our closest ally in the Middle East, but, but we're not going to do what we promised to do because I need the votes from the Muslims, Marge. I need, if, if I send the weapons, as I promised, to help Israel fight a battle that was unfair to begin with, uh, then I won't get the Muslim vote. There mo there's more Muslims than there are Jews in the United States, and I need, uh, I'll, I'll swing, I'll swing, it's like a swinger, Marge. He swings both ways, you know. I don't mean, no, I don't mean gay, I don't mean, uh, you know, uh, what do I mean? Yeah, I'm not sure what I mean. Anyway, uh, <clears throat> so wherever I can pick up the most votes, that's the position I'm going to take, uh, Jill. And I think that's a prudent of me, and uh, I think that's very intelligent on my behalf to, to try to get people's votes. And that's why I'm going to try my hardest in the next couple of months to make the 15 million illegal aliens... I don't like to call them illegal aliens, Marge. The, the, it's true they came and sneaked across the border. But I opened up the border, so they're really not sneaking. They're just going inside the border in, and to get into America so they can have a better life. But I'm going to try to get them to, to be able to vote. And, of course, they'll vote for me, and they won't vote for Trump. Because Trump hates your guts. Trump, March, uh, Jill, does Trump, does Trump think I'm a nice guy? Does he hate me, Marge? I hate him. Does he hate me, does, or does he think I'm cool? Marge, do people think, uh, as a general rule, do they think I'm a cool guy? Huh? They think I'm cool? I've got a new thing uh, when I walk now uh, to and from the helicopter or to and, and from, uh, uh, Air Force One or whatever they call it. Uh, so you don't see me shuffle. I've got my team on each side of me to kind of block, block me as I walk. And then, of course, I have the baby stairs, uh, the baby stairs that I walk up, and then there's a... Uh, going to get some Secret Service men to go up the stairs with me in case I fall backwards or go up ahead of me in case I fall forward. You know, uh, it's not, I've never fallen on my own. It's always because I've been pushed. Uh, the, the, the footage you have of me falling upstairs, I was pushed. It, it happened so fast, there's a hand that came in and pushed me uh, uh, two or three times, and I feel each time that I was pushed. I, there was a hand, I don't know if it was a devil, I don't know who it was, it could have been an angel, I don't know who it was. Marge, but I was pushed, and uh, it wasn't me. But anyway, I have the, uh, the, uh, the, the, the shorter stairs that I can uh, walk up now. And I have special shoes that are, have an equalizer in them. So if I lean a little bit that way, then the shoes go that way. You know, if I lean a little bit that way, then the shoes go that way, you know? 
it, it's it's very it's it, they're very nice shoes. They're expensive shoes. Uh, the uh, citizens paid for because I'm the president. I'm the president of the United States of America, and that's that's and I mean it. I, 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 on my word as a Biden, and and the the uh, citizens paid for my shoes. They were special shoes. They've got special magnets in them, uh, different different wavelengths, so they can keep in touch with the outer space people. And and uh, they were they were they were a bargain at twenty three hundred dollars. Yeah, it, of course, and they they knew I was President Biden. And so they gave me a different price on it because they knew I was president and I can afford it. I can afford anything. Uh, I can afford it. I can go in and to a grocery store and I don't care if the eggs are 50% more or the beef is 30% more. Or, it doesn't matter to me because it doesn't affect me much. It doesn't affect me because I have a, I have a line of credit being the president of the United States, I have a line of credit that I can make any purchase for any amount, and the citizens of the United States are going to pay for it in the form of taxes, or, or you know, it could be a tax on gasoline, it could be a tax on your home, it could be, you know, a, a number of things where you're taxed, the people are taxed, uh, for my benefit, you know. So I can do what I want to do, and 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 no one's going to say anything, March. No one's going to say anything because I'm the president. Do you understand, March, how important your husband is? I'm the president of the United States of America, and you're just a you're a doc. Are you a doctor, Jill? Big deal. No, I don't. No, no, I don't mean that. I mean, I mean it is. It's a big deal. I didn't. I didn't say that in a negative way. That's a big, big deal, Marge, that you're a doctor, that you can oversee people that need your help. And I appreciate it so much when you come in at nighttime, come in when I go to bed about 6.30 and you bring my milk and cookies and sometimes there's some french fries and some muffins. I like blueberry muffins, Marge. You know I like blueberry muffins. And when you bring those muffins to me and... My gummy bears, and I don't know if they're medicine or what, but I like them. I like them, and I'll eat them, Marge. If they're sweet, I like them. I have a sweet tooth, and I, and, and, and I like gummy bears. And people that don't like gummy bears are evil people. And I like dogs. People that don't like dogs are evil, evil people, but people that like cats are idiots. You know, I, I went over to... There's a guy that lives down the street named Ron, and he ha he likes cats. And and I don't know why he likes cats because they are the dumbest animals. They just lay there, say, "Come here, come here, Rover," and they and the cats don't obey you. They just lay there and do their own thing. They're they're not a pet; they're a pest. And and people that like cats. They're either stupid or they're gay. They're queer. Some kind of a, a queerness about them that they like kitty cats. And, and, and I like dogs. Myself, I like dogs. And my dogs like secret service men. They've bitten 24 secret service men. They're not great. March, they're not great secret service men because the dogs bit them. And the Secret Service men didn't know in, in, in advance that the dog was going to bite him. So how good a Secret Service men are they? Really, seriously, Marge. But anyway, I know there's people out there that like kitty cats. But I'm not one of them. I know Ron down the street, he, he loves kitty cats. He thinks they're great. He can have his own... own uh, opinion on that but i know that i'm smarter than anybody else and and my opinions are golden my opinions are so far out in front of everybody else marge do people like me do they do they think that when i walk into a room that they're happy makes a 
the atmosphere of the room happy, or do they want to get rid of me? Uh, I know they want to get rid of Trump. Oh, yeah, he had 100,000 people in Wildwood, uh, New Jersey, the other night, 100,000 people. That's nothing, March. When I have, when I have a, a, uh, when I go and talk to people, there's, a, there's, I don't know, there's at least 200 people there, March. Sometimes there's 225 people, if you count in the Secret Service agents. 100,000 people, I don't know. Uh, he probably had to pay him, March, to show up, you know. Some of those idiots were there, like, two days before. They had to sleep overnight. What kind of an idiot would sleep overnight to see a president that clearly lost the 2020 elections and he's clearly going to lose the 2024 elections. How do I know that? Just, just I, I just know that, Marge. You know it and I know it. And some of the other Democrats know it. That we're going, that, that we're going to win and I don't, and I and there's no way that they're going to be this Marge. We've got Marge. Have you got? Did, did they deliver those uh, ballots? And have you got the ballots? Did they deliver those boxes of ba ballots the other day? Where are they in the in the garage by the Corvette? Yeah, just leave them there. We'll get to them. We'll get to them when we need them. And uh, now I forgot what I was talking about, Marge. Jill, I know I call you Marge all the time. I can't help it. I've got Marge on my mind. I don't know a Marge. I've told you that. I don't know who Marge is. I don't know where I came up with that name at. You know, what would you, what would you like me to call you? Jill? Is that your real name, Jill? Do how about Dr. Jill? How about Dr. Biden? Huh? How about Dr. Jill Biden? Will that make you happy? Huh? Will that make you happy so you can get off my back? I'm not trying to fight. I'm not trying to fight or raise my voice. I don't know how. I don't know. The devil's the devil's making me do it, Mar or Jill. The devil makes me do a lot of things that I normally wouldn't do, but I have to do it because the devil's taking me over, Marge. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. A bunch of losers.